in the last couple of years, actually several years, there has been a trending thing in Hollywood, and that is adapting popular video game franchises, whether for streaming in the form of, you know, live action shows, live action movies for theatrical releases. We've seen plenty of them. And there have been good examples, prime examples of decent video game adaptations. But there are some, well, most actually, that have fumbled and really just fell off the map, so to speak. But the there is no sign of it stopping anytime soon. And so with all these big video game adaptations, there's a few franchises out there that I'm sure fans out there wonder, why haven't they gotten any kind of adaptation? And I'm talking about specifically Blizzard Entertainment. Now, there was a time, I think it was about um, almost, a, almost a decade ago, where they did try to uh, bring World of Warcraft into the silver screen. They made the Warcraft, the movie, uh, and um, honestly, it didn't do very well in the box office. And so I think because of that, they kind of washed their hands out of it. But that doesn't mean it should have been the end. Matter of fact, you know, other big iconic franchises under their belt could have had the potential for amazing adaptations, the likes of StarCraft, Overwatch, Diablo. And recently, there's been some fascinating news that honestly feels like the biggest missed opportunity for Blizzard Entertainment. This comes actually from a recent uh, Reddit thread um, from Ask Me Anything promoting uh, a book. This is by journalist, game, uh, game journalist Jason Schreier. He recently published a book that's, uh, that's titled Play Nice, The Rise, Fall, and Future of Blizzard Entertainment. And he reveals that uh, there were some adaptations actually in the works for Netflix for franchises like StarCraft, Overwatch, and Diablo. However, everything fell apart when Blizzard decided to sue Netflix over a dispute regarding their former chief financial officer, Spencer Newman. Apparently, the story goes that Newman was let go after allegedly breaching his contract to join Netflix in early 2019, and this legal battle seems to have effectively killed any plans for those, for those adaptations, which is honestly very disappointing for fans who have been hoping to see these games brought to life on screen. And I, I, I would say that Netflix would have been the great choice here, especially if it was going to be animated, because they have shown in the past that they can make some really great video game adaptations. Uh, Castlevania, the animated series, uh, Cyberpunk Edge Runners are really great examples of just amazing video game adaptations. And to imagine if there was an Overwatch series, an animated Overwatch series, this is something that has been long requested by many fans of Overwatch, especially when the game was at its peak. We're talking when everybody and anybody was playing this game. They were so desperately looking for, you know, a, a, a narrative mode, a campaign of some kind, because they loved the game so much. They wanted to know more about it in the world. They wanted to know the characters. They wanted storylines, and it could have been achievable. But here we are, unfortunately, after one legal dispute, a lot of this has just been thrown out the window. But I like to always be stoic about this. I mean, it could never be the end. I, I like to think that maybe eventually these adaptations from Blizzard Entertainment could find uh, some, some renewed interest. Maybe there is, but we don't know too much about it. We're looking at the hypothetical of what could have been, honestly. Um... But uh, it, there's a lot of potential for these franchises to continue to prosper, uh, whether in video game form or in an adaptation. I mean, I honestly don't know too much about Diablo, but when I see the cutscenes, and I played Diablo 4 for some time, I look at those cutscenes, I look at the storyline, it is surprisingly very interesting. And I want to delve into it a lot more. I think having it be adapted into a digestible piece of a story would be so cool. And StarCraft also, which is a game that's been around for decades, I'm sure that's just as fascinating in itself. But uh, all we know for now is these are things that, have, that could have been, 
We don't know what would have been. And so it's interesting to look at this and just kind of hypothetically think uh, of what what Blizzard proper, perhaps has in mind in the near future for these franchises because it feels like, especially for Overwatch, there's just a there's this weird sense of stalemate, you know, uh, or stagnation with that franchise. And I think an adaptation would be absolutely amazing. But only time will tell if they will even do anything about it. But uh, if you want to look more into it, I do recommend checking out the, the subreddit, uh, Ask Me Anything, with Jason Schreier, where he talks a little bit more in detail about this, especially if you're a fan of those games. Um, but imagine, what, could have, what, what are actually some video games that you'd love to see adapted, uh, and what form, in animation, in CGI, in live action, whatever it may be, let me know, share your thoughts right here on the Evening Buzz. We're going to take a short break, and coming up next... We're going to be covering still more news from the world of entertainment right here on the Evening Buzz.